Mr. Math here, thanks for watching my videos. Be sure to like and subscribe and remember to click the bell icon to be notified of updates. Hello again viewers, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We are up here in the uh, North Hyrule Sky Archipelago, aiming for this chasm right here, with the intention of heading further west to approximately here, down in the depths. Because that's where we will find uh, the final bargainer statue. So, yeah, it's kind of off in that direction. I think that's... There's, there's a star-shaped sky island out in that way. There it is. That one right there. And it's basically right over the chasm. So if I get myself there... then I can basically just jump down from there. This is easy enough. It's right there. Okay, so this is pretty much right above the chasm. If I just dive down from here, I'm right where I want to be. What the heck? Well, that's surprising. Um, where is that thing going? down into the chasm it appears. I have no idea what's down below. That seems to be the piece that just fell off of that island. It's etched with ancient Hyrulean text. You cannot read it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> oh, dear. That's inconvenient. Can't see a bloody thing. And there's a fox right in front of me. Huh. Let's see. Yigith place over there. Okay, he's backing off. There's a underground tree over there. I can use that for cover if the frog sees me. Do I not, and am I going to have to dismiss you again? More to 
defense. That's what I want right now. Okay, let's check the map. I want to head west. There aren't really any good... Uh, Um, shrines nearby that I know of. There's this one to the east, but that's the wrong direction. There's probably a few down here, but I doubt I can even get in there because there's water. So that's probably a, a barrier. Hmm. Maybe I should go check out that Yiga place. Or maybe I should just make an air bike and head west. <coughs> I do need these things for armor upgrades. Might as well get them when I can. Although it always kind of disappoints me when I look at these things and I momentarily get excited thinking that they're fairies. Only to discover that they're not. That was easy. <laughs> uh, right, here we go. Huh. Now, there's the car. I was about to say, where's the car? you pick that stuff up that's what I wanted you to do as uh, a cannon do we have anything else lots of cannons fans I was thinking I could make a tank you know put something put a barrier at the front so that I can't be hit from there and add a few more weapons to this thing and just drive it off to the west. And that would certainly be fun, but it's a bigger production than I think I want to have to do. Under the Colosseum ruins on the surface, an imposing building, similar to that same Colosseum, has been discovered. There are reports that there are many, as many as six such structures exist in the depths. There's one in the deepest depths below the Korok Forest near here. But there are rumors of eerie growls coming from inside. A courageous team member went to test their metal, but we haven't heard from them in quite a while. We hope they are safe. Glory to Master Koga. Well... That's a Yiga clan member we won't have to worry about, it would appear. Okay, another schematic. What have we got this time? An aerial cannon. 
Huh. I like the sound of that. And of course, a large crystallized charge. Let's actually check that out. What are we looking at here? Huh. A rocket to push it up, two batteries for power, and then a cannon. Hmm. Interesting. Personally, I think I could make some improvements on that design. Well then. Let's just go the simple route. to uh, add on the headlight. I think I want to activate this just to have more light down here. Um, okay, I need to go a bit south. kind of clumsy right now. Maybe I should put on the flame breaker armor as a precaution. Because getting kind of close to Death Mountain over there. Although, now that I think about it, there is that abandoned mine under Goron City. I saw it briefly when I was over there working with Unobo. But I didn't go to it because I assumed it would be part of the Master Koga quest line. And I didn't want to hit it too early. But it turns out that it's not. The Master Koga quest line is under Rito Village, not Goron City. Yeah. Alright, that's the big old thing heading up. 
I saw from the distance. Ah, darn it. Some hover stones, fans, a hot air balloon. No control stick though, so I couldn't make my air bike here. Holding down the button. Come back here, you. What? Why is it just... What the heck? Here, you stupid... Ow! Darn it! I can't react fast enough! Irritating. At least it seems to be done playing around with me now. These guys. Irritating experience.
Okay. Let's relax by gathering some resources. Take the zonite that they're mining. Because that's what they're doing over there, I'm sure of it. Every enemy encampment down here seems to be a zonite mine. There's got to be more shrines around here that I don't know about. Unfortunately, that doesn't help me very much. Not right now, anyway. There, hover stones, a few other minor things. Okay, here's where I came in. really high so that this guy won't be too much of a threat oh look at that another mini boss down there. Let's make for it. Cute name. Nick a kick. Sounds like something out of a Wizard of Oz novel. Gave me quite a bit of light. Right then. 
Yep. So there will be a shrine here. have a good view of anything else down here. It's a pretty deep little hole. Glad to spend some time exploring a mine. Eek. we have here? Probably more crystallized charges? Yep. And... Okay, looks like I'm gonna need Unobo. Well, I guess technically I don't need Unobo. I'm gonna have him help me out anyway. <laughs> Come out and make yourself useful. Two more. The problem is getting to them.
Did I just hear those baby foxes? one of them it would appear. final destination. So good. Now let's see. Okay, that that hole over there. I can't tell for sure about that hole though. No, that doesn't have any. What about that hole? Nothing here. Okay. Looks like I've cleared out this mine. a wall or just a mountain? Tall wall. Uh oh. Ah. That's not the light route I'm looking for. But. What the? Huh. 
Rito statues. I can imagine where those would lead me. But that's not where I want to go in this episode. I see another light route there in the distance. That might be the one I'm actually looking for. platforms which is unless I'm mistaken where you go to refight the temple bosses okay I thought I saw a aha there Okay, so I need to go that general direction. Alright. Nobo, okay. Enough. Enough is enough. What's aggroed on me? I don't care. I just want to find that light route. Big old robot. What's going on over there? This is uncomfortably close to a bunch of enemies. I think I will make a kill bot and kill them. That's got to be where the Bargainer statue is. And I want to get rid of those guys so that they don't get in my way. So. Yes, I think that's a good base to start from. Okay, so. Three beam emitters. Homing cart, construct head. And then also, of course, a stabilizer. And flame emitter. Okay. <laughs> 
this guy right here. Put this guy on top of that. And then Oh right. Star, okay. All your friends are dead. So, you know, honk your horn as many times as you want. that thing. Bots in the way. Okay, the extra zone is good, but I was more worried about those guys getting in my way when I went to investigate that. laying around. Those guys up there shot quite a few arrows, it would appear. Boy, nice halberds aren't very great. The soldiers' halberds are better. Strengthen Lazal bow. I better take a picture of that. Right then, with all those jerks out of the way. Looks like it's basically right up front there. No, 
no, no, no, no, no. That's... What's with all the mist? Has it gotten cold? Or is it just that I'm really close to the ceiling now? Well, you who stand before me, yada yada yada, blah blah blah, same old, same old. Encounter my brethren. The Tunic of Memories. Oh. Well. The tunic of the hero. Okay. I'm glad I was grabbing lots of pose all the time then. Wait a minute, times two? So I already had one? Huh, I did already have one. Pa. Okay, hmm. Well, I'm going to have to investigate that. And by investigate, I mean go to a great fairy and see if I can power it up. That should be all the bargainer statues. I mean, it should be. No idea if it is. Okay, let's remove that. And you know, the next uh, light route doesn't look to be too far away. Let's go find it. <laughs> Must be it right up ahead. I have to do some circling to get down to it. pretty happy about this. Found the final bargainer statue. I'm pretty sure it's the final one. And is that another Yiga camp off in the distance there?
Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Hmm. Yeah, honestly, that's further away than I feel like going right now. This has been a pretty productive trip. Got uh, all of this filled in here. Okay, where's my air bike? else worth checking out as long as I'm in the area. <laughs> eh, nothing really here. All right, well, I accomplished my immediate goal found the final bargainer statue. Hmm. What I might want to do when I have the time, go back to Lookout Landing, go down the nearby chasm, and fill in all of these. Oh, also, What's here? Well, I could get those treasures, whatever they are. Hmm. Yeah, I went south. But I haven't gone north. Not even a little ways. However, at the moment, what I really want to do is go to one of the great fairies. And see what I can do with all of this uh, new armor I've got. Then, Great Fairy, here we come.
light dragon scale. I'll admit that makes sense, but darn it. <laughs> Ruby and Zonite. Well, I've certainly got plenty of that. Mm. Uh. <sighs> Let me guess. For two stars, it'll be uh, Ruby and Large Zonite? Uh. Mm. Uh. No? No? Regular Zonite. Mm. 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 <laughs> <laughs> now then, I got a bunch of Sunset Fireflies specifically for these. Mm. Uh. Sneaky river snails. Uh. And sticky frogs. Mm. I essentially have mm. none of those. Wings, okay. Mm. Mm. Well, once I find the rest of the climbing gear, I can. I should be able to upgrade all of it. And come to think of it, I uh. do know where one of them is. There's these things. of stuff upgraded now. I still have a ways to go. Deep fireflies. That's all I need for these. Okay. Oh, bother. 
I have enough of the fangs, I don't have enough of the dark clumps. Well, I could buy more at a bargainer statue. Mm. Ah. Disappointing. Just five more dark clumps to upgrade the whole set. I am unfortunately done with the uh, set of the depths for now. Let's see, more dark clumps. Oh, wow. If I had the final piece of this set, I would definitely upgrade that. large zonite, but I don't want to go up to level 3. Ruby and Star Fragment for that. Hinox Toenail, Dinral Scale, Nadra Scale, Farasha Scale. I can do it. Mm. Let's upgrade these to 1 star. Uh. I need the claws and Hinox teeth, which I don't have many of. So this gives me night speed up. Uh, I am really disappointed that I didn't have the stuff I need for this. Okay, well. Back to Lookout Landing, briefly. Da, da, da. We're just about done with the episode, but... While I'm here, Pip. Uh, 
Hey, Joshua. Uh -huh. Hi, swordsman. Listen to this. I received new info about the depths. Okay. Some investigators followed the stone statues discovered at the bottom of the chasms. Oh. The stone statues led directly beneath Zora's domain and they discovered evidence of a civilization there. When we dug a little deeper, we learned that the statues in the southwest led beneath Gerudo Town. So I was thinking there may be a connection between the surface and the depths. So I tried investigating the chasms in every region to follow my hunch. Oh. And then we found a new chasm on the cliff face at Rito Village in Hebra to the northwest. On the cliff face. Next, I'm thinking of having them check whether it's possible to go, possible to go directly under the village from that point. <laughs> I've been learning one thing after another about the depths lately. It's gotten me super motivated. I'll keep gathering info about the depths so I can be useful to you, swordsman. Check back later, okay? Oh. I bet other people can feel that we're getting close to figuring out more about the princess. You and me, swordsman, I just know we can do this. I'm sure we can. Let's just get all of them. Hmm. They don't all have everything. That's odd. Well, I guess it's not so odd. Right. This has been a decently productive episode, in my opinion. We found the final bargainer statue, which was somewhere around here. And uh, found several more light routes around the depths. And did a whole lot of upgrading at the Great Ferry. We could do a little bit more, but uh, eh, we'll save that for later. So, I'm going to end the episode here. Thanks for watching Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. My plan in the next episode is to go hunting for more bits of armor. There are two pieces of the Royal Guard uniform set that I haven't gotten yet, and I know that they're both up in the floating Hyrule Castle. So I'm going to go there first. I'll just launch myself out of the Skyview Tower here and glide over there with the glide clothes. And then there's another piece of the climbing set that ought to be like right around here, according to the information I've gathered. So I can just go to this Skyview Tower and pop over there. After that, assuming I have time, I'm going to go down this chasm here and uh, investigate this area around here. See about finding this treasure and hopefully this treasure also. That's my plan as it stands right now. So, viewers, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.